if we can keep our minds open in the sense that whenever we encounter a new task, we don't immediately zone in as, as much as possible to the immediate goal. But we keep our minds open to the fact that sometimes the, um, the most obvious solution, the most obvious path is not the best path. Practical world changing creativity requires both your ability to generate ideas, generate possibility, but also very much requires your ability to um, take those the best ideas and be able to sort out the good ones from the bad ones, which ones are worth pursuing and, and using that very focused attention. So there's there's various stages. There's this open stage and there's this more uh, closed stage, uh, more, more focused stage, I would say. The most important thing is is shifting the spotlight of attention um, that, that is within us to, um, um, to that broad network. So it's like opening up that spotlight of attention, okay, which is narrow. But we need to have the patience to allow ourselves to get to that state because we're most of the time we live in the, in the world of prefrontal cortex where we have, we have this very goal-directed things. What we need to do is get out of a goal-directed state and we have to be patient um, to allow ourselves to get out of it.